The wolf, Canis lupus, also known as the gray wolf or gray wolf, is a large canine native to Eurasia and North America. More than 30 subspecies of Canis lupus have been recognized, and gray wolves, as colloquially understood, comprise non-domestic slash feral subspecies. The wolf is the largest extant member of the family Canidae, males averaging 40 kilograms, 88 pounds, and females 37 kilograms, 82 pounds. Wolves measure 105-160 cm, 41-63 in, in length and 80-85 cm, 31-33 in, at shoulder height. The wolf is also distinguished from other Canis species by its less pointed ears and muzzle, as well as a shorter torso and a longer tail. The wolf is nonetheless related closely enough to smaller Canis species, such as the coyote and the golden jackal, to produce fertile hybrids with them. The banded fur of a wolf is usually mottled white, brown, gray, and black, although subspecies in the Arctic region may be nearly all white. Of all members of the genus Canis, the wolf is most specialized for cooperative game hunting as demonstrated by its physical adaptations to tackling large prey, its more social nature, and its highly advanced expressive behavior. It travels in nuclear families consisting of a mated pair accompanied by their offspring. Offspring may leave to form their own packs on the onset of sexual maturity and in response to competition for food within the pack. Wolves are also territorial and fights over territory are among the principal causes of wolf mortality. The wolf is mainly a carnivore and feeds on large wild hooved mammals as well as smaller animals, livestock, carrion, and garbage. Single wolves or mated pairs typically have higher success rates in hunting than do large packs. The wolf is the largest extant member of the Canidae family, and is further distinguished from coyotes and jackals by a broader snout, shorter ears, a shorter torso and a longer tail. It is slender and powerfully built, with a large, deeply descending ribcage, a sloping back, and a heavily muscled neck. The wolf's legs are moderately longer than those of other canids, which enables the animal to move swiftly and to overcome the deep snow that covers most of its geographical range in winter. The ears are relatively small and triangular. The wolf's head is large and heavy, with a wide forehead, strong jaws and a long, blunt muzzle. The skull is 232 atm, 911 in, in length and 131 50 m, 5 6 in, in width. The teeth are heavy and large making them better suited to crushing bone than those of other canids. They are not as specialized as those found in hyenas though. Its molars have a flat chewing surface, but not to the same extent as the coyote, whose diet contains more vegetable matter. Females tend to have narrower muzzles and foreheads, thinner necks, slightly shorter legs, and less massive shoulders than males. The mean body mass of the wolf is 40 kilograms, 88 pounds, the smallest specimen recorded at 12 kilograms, 26 pounds, and the largest at 79.4 kilograms, 175 pounds. On average, European wolves weigh 38.5 kilograms, 85 pounds, North American wolves 36 kilograms, 79 pounds, and Indian and Arabian wolves 25 kilograms, 55 pounds. Females in any given wolf population typically weigh 2.34. 5 kilograms, 5 10 pound, less than males. The wolf has very dense and fluffy winter fur, with a short undercoat and long, coarse scarred hairs. The winter fur is highly resistant to the cold. Wolves in northern climates can rest comfortably in open areas at 40 degrees Celsius, question mark 40 degrees Fahrenheit, by placing their muzzles between the rear legs and covering their faces with their tail. A wolf's coat color is determined by its scarred hairs. Wolves usually have some hairs that are white, brown, gray and black. The coat of the Eurasian wolf is a mixture of ochreous, yellow to orange and rusty ochreous, orange slash red slash brown, colors with light gray. In North America, the coat colors of wolves follow Gloger's rule, wolves in the Canadian Arctic being white and those in southern Canada, the US, 
and Mexico being predominantly grey. In some areas of the Rocky Mountains of Alberta and British Columbia, the coat color is predominantly black, some being blue-gray and some with silver and black. Like all land mammals that are pack hunters, the wolf feeds predominantly on wild herbivorous hoofed mammals that can be divided into large size 246 50 kg, 531, 430 pounds, and medium size 23 130 kg. 51 to 87 pound, and have a body mass similar to that of the combined mass of the pack members. The wolf specializes in preying on the vulnerable individuals of large prey, with a pack of 15 able to bring down an adult moose. In modern times, the wolf occurs mostly in wilderness and remote areas. The wolf can be found between sea level and 3,000 meters, 9,800 feet. Wolves live in forests, inland wetlands, shrublands, grasslands, including arctic tundra, pastures, deserts, and rocky peaks on mountains. Habitat used by wolves depends on the abundance of prey, snow conditions, livestock densities, road densities, human presence and topography. The wolf is a social animal. Its populations consist of packs and lone wolves, most lone wolves being temporarily alone while they disperse from packs to form their own. Wolves communicate to anticipate what their pack mates or other wolves might do next. This includes the use of vocalization, body posture, scent, touch, and taste. The phases of the moon have no effect on wolf vocalization, and despite popular belief, wolves do not howl at the moon. Thank you for watching video from Earth XP.